The Nanaimo Community Hospice Society is working to raise more than a million dollars for its new hospice house. With the help of corporate and private donations, the society hopes to come up with the money by the end of this year. But a significant share of the money will also come from a grassroots project built from the ground up by people who know firsthand how valuable hospice is. CTV's Jet Bassey reports. It is officially open for business, Nanaimo's second hospice thrift shop. From the floor to the ceiling to the electrical work, every inch has been hammered and wired by project manager Gary Zobel's crew. A team of volunteer skilled tradesmen brought together by a common project and a common loss. Very many of them share the fact that they have gone through some kind of a grief experience in their life, lost someone important to them. Um, a lot of them are just wanting to integrate back into society and have somewhere to go. When Roy's grandson died, hospice was there for support. Now he is giving back, spending four hours a week getting his hands dirty and keeping his spirits up. It's a nice little spot in my week this Thursday morning, and uh, the women are great to, to work alongside, you know, really good people. And the, the clientele that come in here are really good people too, you know, they're having a tough time, a lot of them, you know, and uh, it's nice to be able to help them out to find something that they can use. When Gerald lost his wife, he felt the need to take on something meaningful that would get him out of the house and give him a new purpose. So he spends eight hours a week doing odd jobs in the shop. You help them out, you make a lot of friends, you... It's social more than anything. You come in, you have your coffee. It's a no sweat policy, so <laughs> keep going. <laughs> His son worked side by side with him during the renovations. He says volunteering has brought his dad new joy. I see the, the spring in his step, you know, it's a good thing for him, you know, it's brought happiness back into his life, you know, meeting a few people in similar situations. More than 100 volunteers help run the two shops. The shop is their clubhouse. They work hard, play hard, and rejuvenate their spirits. Philosophy of hospice is helping people, right? I mean, that's, that's what they're there for, to help, help people's uh, peace of mind. Hour by hour, day by day, these dedicated volunteers will help hospice raise more than $1 million for a new hospice house. Jeff Bassey, CTV News, Nanaimo.